Well, just say the word summer and a number of hobbies and activities immediately come to mind. Some go swimming, others cook out and try to become grill masters. Cooking or burning, if you're like me, food on the barbie for friends and family. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> Once tonight's installment of Tougher Summer Jobs, WTXL ABC 27's Jennifer Myers is getting a first class education on cooking with fire during the dog days of summer. Summertime. Temperatures sizzling, and so are the barbecue yeah. pits. No matter where you live on the planet, when you think summer, you think barbecue. And in the South, that's a way of life. Everyone loves barbecue, you know. Um, it's America, you know. Everybody, everybody likes barbecue. Meet, pun intended, Lorenzo Sampson. He's a local pit master with over 20 years in the smoke. Cooking up food and serving it to the community is Samson's passion that all started when he was just a boy. I've always, you know, been interested in cooking. Uh, my mom, you know, had me in the kitchen, you know, she taught me all the basic essentials of cooking. Basic essentials he right. still uses today. I make everything a lot of That's the only way to be. Smoke and Lowe's has a ton of repeat customers, and for a lot of them, it was a love at first bite. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Whatever his recipe is for the potato salad and the baked beans is really good. It's like, you know, my grandma used to make, so I love coming here. Cooking up tasty foods on the barbecue pit isn't an easy task, especially since his grills are outside in the elements. Oh, it slows the cooking down a little bit, you know, as far as cooling the grills down when it rains, so it takes a little bit more heat and effort to uh, cook, make sure the food is cooked. Rain isn't the only challenge. Samson also cooks during those hot and humid days. And if you live in South Georgia or North Florida, you know those all too well. I don't take breaks, you know. I um, Anytime that I'm idle, I just try to find a way to stay busy, you know, because there's always something to do in this business. And smoking Lowe's stays busy. Thank you very much. It's his grit constant effort and passion for cooking that brings Lorenzo Sampson into the running for the title of toughest summer job. It's expected to be 90 degrees. Uh, by cooking by the grill, it's about 200 degrees. I'm a barbecue extraordinaire, so it's, I got the toughest job this summer. In Tallahassee, Jennifer Myers, WTXL ABC 27. And Jennifer got to indulge a little bit. I know. I'm so jealous. That's a tough summer job, and we certainly appreciate the work that he does. And I'm a little hungry. I know. She made me hungry, too. I know. <laughs> well, the polls are open for you to vote on who you think has the toughest summer job. And next week, we'll see the final job in the running for the toughest of the toughest summer job. And in two weeks, we will announce the win winner. And to see tonight's story again or to vote, go to our website now at WTXL.TV. And a lot of people are taking part in this.